And on the Health Beat this afternoon, we're talking about Alzheimer's, which is the sixth leading cause of death and very difficult to diagnose. That's what we're talking about today with Dr. Rishi Mopsecker. He's with Northwest Radiology. It's great to have you here. Thanks for having me, Scott. Why is Alzheimer's so difficult to diagnose? Uh, Alzheimer's, uh, it's the most common form of dementia. Uh, and the reason it's hard to diagnose is because it can present uh, as many other forms of dementia. Mm. Uh, as people get older, uh, it's not uncommon for them uh, to become forgetful. But uh, that's one of the things that people with Alzheimer's have. And your, your group at uh, Northwest Radiology is doing some scans on a number of people. What's the purpose of these scans? That's correct. So current medical imaging, which would be CAT scans or MRIs or PET scans, they, uh, they, their mainly, uh, their main purpose is to show us the anatomical structure of the brain. We know that in Alzheimer's disease, uh, a certain protein called beta amyloid has increased deposition in the brain. Uh, that protein is toxic to brain cells. And uh, that protein is commonly seen in older people also, but to a great extent in people with Alzheimer's disease. And you're looking for folks to participate in this particular study. Correct. Who, who do you want to see in this study? Who do you want contacting you? Alzheimer's typically presents in patients. It starts presenting at people in their mid-60s and exponentially increases, the symptoms increase. The study that, uh, the IDEA study that we're uh, promoting is a study where we can actually see the amyloid deposition in the brain. So that's a, it's, it's a new tool, it's, uh, it's a great resource. So uh, people that we're targeting are people uh, that might have mild cognitive impairment, people you know, that might be having signs of dementia. And uh, you know, we would tell these people to go see the neurologist. These are doctors that specialize in dementia, right. and then they can refer them to us. Okay, and again, if we've got, if you're interested in contacting and be a part of this study, we can put you in touch with the folks at Northwest Radiology. You can go on to WTHR.com. We've got more information for you there. Doctor, it's good to talk to you. Thanks so much for talking. My pleasure. Thanks for having me. Appreciate it.